Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, Ron's Keto Cafe. Well, today we're making this crunchy bacon, but not just bacon. We're going to cook this in the conventional oven. And this is really, really a great way of uh, you know, cooking bacon without all the bacon greasy mess. Now, I love bacon, and I can have bacon just about any time of day for a snack. It's a great carnivore snack. And uh, if you just follow me along, you'll be fine. And you're going to separate the bacon and put it on a sheeting pan like I'm doing. And uh, it's regular store-bought bacon. At the end of the day, you get what you can afford. So what I did was I lined up a uh, sheeting pan with aluminum foil, got the oven going to about 400 degrees or so, and then we just popped that baby in the oven for about 30 minutes. And then we flipped it at the halfway point. And then after the uh, bacon was fully cooked, I put it into a bowl. And uh, we ended up draining off some of the grease. Now, you can save your bacon grease if you got a grease container for bacon. And they uh, have to uh, and strain it. And then you can use it for uh, meals. For bacon grease is really, really great uh, source of protein. Uh, and, of course, you know, everybody knows uh, bacon is a sinful food. And, you know, bacon tastes good with just about anything in here. I'm just taking the uh, bacon and I'm laying it out and I'm separating it. And uh, I, I, on my particular sheet pan, I ended up getting a whole pound of bacon on there. This is regular store-bought bacon. I get to be careful with the sodium and bacon there because you're trying to eliminate as much salt as you can. And just keep the uh, your sodium down to a, uh, you know, the appropriate sodium that you're allowed to have on a ketogenic lifestyle. So just follow me along with uh, what I'm doing, and you guys will be fine. And again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Love you guys. Sorry about the noise over the voiceover when I'm doing these videos, guys, but I do live in an apartment complex, and we do live out on the main street area, and uh, it's very noisy here at time to time, and that's why I elected to do a lot of these videos this way. And uh, yeah, so I'm looking at the bacon video, and I, this came out really, really great. And again, again, it's not something you want to just put in the oven and forget about it and walk away from it. Just keep an eye on your bacon, especially if you're doing it over the stove or in the air fryer because you don't want to set up a uh, smoke alarm or anything like that like I've done in the past. And uh, yeah, it wouldn't be a good thing. And look at how nice and crunchy that bacon is. And then, you know, I didn't save this particular bacon grease, but I do plan on getting a... Uh, bacon uh, container so I can store the uh, grease so I can have, use it for uh, flavoring on my meals such as eggs and stuff like that. Anyways, again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Love you guys. Stay safe, stay healthy. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.